All right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can instantly improve the speed of your pop-up. It's just a simple technique tweak. So when you apply these, you can actually improve the speed of your pop-up today. Um, it's gonna make your pop-up faster, first of all, but second, it'll make your pop-up a lot more reliable, meaning your feet will land in the same place every single time, and it's also gonna help turn your body so you're going down the line when you pop up rather than going straight and then having to make your turn. Super simple stuff. Um, these are funny techniques because um, it's, they call it the curse of knowledge, right? Where I've just always done it. I take for granted that not everyone knows it. And I made a post about this on Instagram and I uh, had a really good response. So this is the follow up, a lot more detail about how to do it and why it works. So let's get started. All right, step one is where you place your hands. Now the mistake is popping up with your hands too far forward. So first of all, when you push up like this, your, your hands are out past you a little bit, past your center of gravity, so you're reaching a bit. So it's like a reaching and a push, and when you pop up, it's like an explosion, right? And you do that fast, when you're doing that kind of a reach, it puts lots of tension on your shoulders, can hurt it. But also, it's a greater distance to travel, like to push your arms, you gotta have them completely extended before your, um, your chest is up high enough. So what you do is, rather than push up here, you push up behind your shoulders, so like where your nipples are, like a little bit past there. And so if you look, by the time my elbows are only half the way um, straightened, my arms are straightened, um, my chest is already way up. So it shortens the amount of time it takes to get your chest up, shortens the distance your arms have to bend. So to get my chest fully up this way, look, it's my, I have to straighten my arms there. Here, it's way less, right? So that shortens the distance, right? takes less pressure off your shoulders. So you can explode out of there a lot more safely so you won't hurt your shoulders and the distance to travel is a little less. So that improves the speed. And that's number one. Number two is you wanna stagger your hands. So this, this is actually a funny one, I got a story. So um, I had a guy join my uh, Waterman Elite group um, and he is lives in Japan and he's a rep for Firewire, so he handles the sales over in Japan. Um, and he's been doing it for a long, long time. And he was telling me a story when I talked to him on the phone when he was signing up. So when guys like Kelly Slater, Rob Machado, the Firewire guys are in Japan, he hosts them. So they stay with him, he brings them to the spots and all that stuff. And he decided to join my program because I had mentioned this previously, the hand stagger I'm about to show you. And he said it instantly improved his pop-up. And when I got him on the phone, and we were talking, he told me about how it improved it instantly, and that's why he booked the call. And he said, he made a joke, he's like, I mean, all the time that I surfed with Kelly Slater, he never told me that. So I thought that was hilarious that, um, but like, Kelly Slater's business is not there helping people improve their surfing, but mine is, so I don't know, I just thought that was really, really funny. And Robbie, if you're watching this, um, I appreciated that comment. He actually got injured, I haven't talked to him in a while, so Robbie, also hope you're doing good if you're hearing this. So, um, the hand stagger. So lay on your belly. Hands are back, your hands are staggered like this, right? So I'm goofy footed, so I'm right foot forward. So that means my shoulders have to turn this way to go down the line. So if I'm staying like this and my hands are square, my shoulders have a greater distance to travel to get this to this way. But if I stagger my hands, my shoulders are already staggered, right? See this shoulders drop back. And so as I'm popping up this, I'm already looking down the line as opposed to this. Turning the head, it's automatically turned, right? So subtle, but so massive. So paddle, 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 hands are staggered, boom! And so when your shoulders are turned sooner, your hips turn sooner, and this foot comes around a lot easier. So it's all, it's like a chain, right? They all come one after the other. Earlier shoulder turn means earlier hips, means earlier feet. So it shortens the distance it takes you to get your feet where they need to be, and you're already looking down the line. So, hands back here, shorten that distance. Hands staggered, shorten that rotation distance. Your pop-up becomes instantly twice as fast. So, and the cool thing about it is, not much else about the pop-up changes, just where you place your hands. It's so subtle, but so significant when it comes to pop-up speed. So try that, and I'd really love to know what you think. So I'll just demonstrate what it would look like hit real speed. So I'll just show you, I'll show you hands square. So it's like a lot more turn and then hands stagger. It's just so much easier, so much less distance to travel. Um, and that's it. So 
If you like this video, I'd like to know, uh, see a comment. So try this technique and let me know how it works for you. And if you do like this kind of free content, the easiest way for you to support me is to hit the like button. So it'll show other people this video is good. Um, and it'll help more people find it. And also just subscribe. I really appreciate that. My name is Kyle Russ. This is Hydro Mind. Thanks a lot for watching. Hey, one last thing. Do you like catching waves? Yeah, me too. How would you like to catch thousands of more waves in your lifetime? Down below in the description, there's a link. It goes to a step-by-step -step guide that'll show you how I help surfers double their session length in as short as a month, give them confidence surfing overhead waves, fix your pop-up, and shorten the distance it takes you to go from where you are as a surfer to where you want to be. It's all at home training. It's super, super reliable. We're helping surfers all over the world, and I want you to be one of them. If you're interested, totally free training down below. Link in the description. Click that link. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.